Okay, this is a video response for best damn tutoring video of the matrix. This will be how to actually use the uh, matrix editor on your TI-83. First, turn the calculator on by pressing the on key. Press second and matrix. You'll see a menu here of various matrix names. Use your right arrow key to move over to edit and we'll use matrix A to input this matrix. Press enter. As you can see, this is a 3x4 matrix, 3 rows, and 4 columns. So we'll input 3, arrow over, and 4. Now arrow down, and simply enter the numbers in this matrix. 3, press enter, and it automatically moves you over to the next element. Then input 4, enter negative 2, enter, 6, enter, and it moves you down to the next row. So you don't need to use your arrow keys. It automatically moves you to the next spot you need to input your numbers. Then 1, enter, 2, enter, and now where there's a 0, just press 0 and then press enter. 4, enter, and now on the last row, 0, enter, 1, enter, negative 7, enter, and 3, enter. Once this is done, press your second key and quit. Go back into the matrix by pressing second and the X inverse matrix is right over that key. Move 1 to the right with your right arrow key under math. Press the up arrow and move up until you find Reduce Row Echelon Form, RREF, press Enter, go back to the matrix, and select the matrix that we just put the information into, matrix A, Enter, close parentheses, and is put the matrix into Reduce Row Echelon Form. Now, the numbers that appear in the last column will be the solutions to the problem. So x here is negative 2, y is 3, and z is 0. And that would be how to input this matrix into your TIE 3.